Hi everybody, Chris Remis, a Coal Banker here from my video blog. Thought it would be helpful today if we talked about some of the most frequent questions that buyers ask while they're looking for a house. So one of the first questions that people ask me is about the location and what's the best place to live is what people generally ask me. And it really kind of depends on you and what you need, where you work, what you're looking for in the neighborhood, uh, location to uh, proximity to public transportation. So every neighborhood's a little bit different. You know, I usually like to sit down with buyers and talk uh, and meet with them before we start uh, before we start our house our house search uh, to talk about these things. So there's a lot of you know there's a lot of different locations, there's a lot of different neighborhoods in Boston, and it really depends on what you're looking for. You know, so one of the questions that I always ask people that they a lot of times people don't really think about themselves is you know what's my commute going to look like to work? I really feel like if you're going to go over 30 minutes for your commute it has a big impact on your quality of life. So I know everybody wants to get hung up on bedrooms, baths, location, uh, you know, parking, things like that. But you know, your location and your proximity to work, as well as your partner's proximity to work and who's, who works from home and who, who, who has to do all the traveling, it's, it's a big deal and it's something that a lot of times when people are living in the city, they don't consider uh, upfront as much as they should. So one thing that a lot of people ask about are the utilities. You know, as soon as I have a buyer uh, expresses any interest in a house, and I think that there's you know a high level of interest in the house, I'll ask the uh, I'll ask the listing agent if they can provide us with the history of the utilities. I always warn the buyers that you know just just because this is the way that the uh, the current seller, this is their bills. The, it, it, your utility bills are really going to depend on you know your usage, how you how how often your home, how high you like the temperature. You know, another thing to always consider too is the condo fee. You know, every house you walk in, every condo that you walk into, you want to ask about the condo fee and what they include. Condo fees, you can look at one and think it's it's very low, but if it doesn't include the heat and the hot water, you know, you might be paying a lot more in the long run. So you really want to kind of understand, you know, how the utilities are going to relate to the condo fee and what's included in your condo fee. If the heat and hot water are or are not included in the condo fee, it's really going to make a big impact on your monthly expenses. And you really want to understand, you know, what you're paying for in your condo fee and what you're not paying for in your condo fee. Another question that people ask is people will always want to know, you know, what questions, Chris, what questions should I be asking? If I go into an open house, what questions should I be asking the listing agent? You know, I always tell people you want to understand, you know, some of the big ticket items in the house. You want to know the age of the roof, when it was replaced, has there been have there been any any le recent leaks? You want to understand how old the the, uh, the heating system is, what the monthly heating costs are. You know, you also want to know about the hot water heater, how old that is, and, and the HVAC system, and whether is there is air conditioning, is it properly maintained? Uh, there's no question. You shouldn't be shy about asking any question when you're looking for a home. Okay, everybody. Well, that's what we have for today. Uh, we wrapped it up. We're going to wrap it up. We had some great questions on what to questions to ask for when you're buying a house. Feel free to reach out if you have any other things that you want to know about that I can make a video for. My name's Chris Remis. My contact information is below, and the best way to reach me is at 617-398-0018. Thanks for stopping by.